Today's sponsored video goes to the Air Pro 6, a very nice and high quality sounds earbuds that can be taken into your workouts, playing your recreational sports or competitive sports in terms of your own training or with your team. These are very nice earbuds, very lightweight and very accessible for all smartphones from different brands. All you need is just a Bluetooth connection um, and charging is very easy and simple as well, which comes within the box. The sounds and high quality is just as good or even better as the expensive ones that you have currently in the market through your Apple AirPods and Samsung and they're very reliable in terms of the durability of them as we've used them for some time. So make sure to check out this product in the links below in this video and get yourself a pair for a very nice price and high quality sounds. We've tested them out so they're very reliable from our end. You do get some cheap ones from other brands that break very easily or have not very good sounds. This one's cheap and gives you good quality sounds as well. So make sure to check them out. How's it going everyone and hope you're doing well. Welcome to this unboxing and boot review video of the Adidas F50 Elite. These are the laceless editions, so a very nice pair of speed boots, especially for people that like the Adidas laceless models. Very less distraction or no distraction whatsoever on the laces system. A very nice and clean strike when shooting and passing with these boots. And it comes with the nice little heel clipper to help you put your feet into the boots themselves. As you would know from previous videos that we've done of the older colorways, these Adidas F50s laceless models are more targeted for narrow to normal feet types. For wide feet, you can try them on and try the various different sizings. However, if they do not fit you, then go for a different pair of the Adidas football boots models, such as the Predators or the Copas. For wide feet, we recommend going anywhere from a half size up. If you need to go one full size up, you can try them out in the Adidas store or local football boot store that sell these. Or you can also order them online and just return the one that doesn't fit as well. Again, after going half to one full size up for wide feet, if you feel like there's some certain areas that isn't quite comfortable or it's too tight or too much space, it can just mean the design and the shaping of the boots doesn't fit your feet types. And as we always recommend, go for the Predators or Copas, which is much more accommodating for wide and very wide feet. Now for narrow feet types, we recommend anywhere from a half size down to one full size down, depending on how narrow your feet types. Some people that have very narrow feet, you would need to go one full size down to get that tighter and snug fit, as there's no laces in the midfoot to do up to give you that tighter lockdown. Um, and tighter fits once you've done up the laces. So anywhere from a half to one size down is, is required. However, the usual, usual aspects for narrow feet is a half size down, which we should give you that nice and comfortable fit. For normal feet types, again, true to size to a half size down, that is the range. For to get that snug and tighter fit, it is better to go a half size down. If you do like a bit more leeway in all aspects of the boots, then just go true to size. Make sure to leave a comment down below also in this video in terms of your own feet types and how you find the, the sizing and fit in terms of the, 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 the size that you order from as your feedback and your recommendation really helps out people watching this video now or in future reference make a decision to see if these boots are for them or whether they should go for a different pair of boots. Now sole plate wise these can be worn on FG pitches. Again if you're going to be playing on two different pitches as AG as well, uh, synthetic grass, then we recommend for the season to go for the FG rather than the AG. 
AG sole plates is more targeted for just synthetic and AG pitches. You shouldn't really be wearing AG on FG pitches. However, you can get away with wearing FG on AG as well. Some people just don't have the budget or majority of people don't have the budget or sponsorship to wear two pairs of different sole plates. So go for these ones and you can wear them on two different surfaces. Comes with a string bag so you don't have to get yourself a pair. However, if you don't like the string bag that Adidas offer with the holes, um, then just go for you know a very cheap 10, 15 euros or pound string bag, which can be found in your local Adidas store or on their website on app. Again, do give them at least one to two weeks use out of the box before you take them into a match or team training, just for the material to soften up on the upper and for you to get used to the boots themselves. Then that way you can use them after that, that time period um, in terms of you've already had a bit of practice with your friends or by yourself and then that can reduce any chance of injuries or hurting yourself and also better uh, performance base as well in terms of the small details help you out in that sense. Now for 2G and sand pitches or flat concrete pitches go for the turf editions of the F50s which we've done a review on our channel so make sure to have a look on there. Don't wear these on, on the flat pitches or 2G sand as it will just break the sole plates and it will reduce the durability of the boots themselves. But thanks again for watching this quick review of these beautiful Adidas F50 Elites, the laces models. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave it a like and to subscribe to our channel. And we'll see you next time for another unboxing and review in the near future. All the very best and take care.